Recruiting and retaining great people is the key to any company's success. It's definitely been the key to our company's success. There are a couple great ways to do that. The first is making sure that your employees feel connected to the overall mission of the company. The second is making sure that they feel connected to the overall strategy of the company, that they understand why the company makes the decisions it does. The third is making sure that they understand how their work directly ties to the company's mission and strategy. They want to feel that what they're working on every day is important and somehow ties up to something larger. And the fourth, and, and frankly the, the most difficult thing to do, is to try to develop career pathing for people. Now, career pathing is, is, is very is easier to say than it is to do, but when you hire all these great, ambitious, talented people, of course they want to get ahead. The ways to do that are to create programs and, and systems for them to actually get advancement within your company. But it's also about explaining to people that there are a lot of ways to get ahead. It doesn't just mean sort of getting a direct promotion the way you know our parents or grandparents might have thought about career development, where they were staying at companies for 30 or 40 years. Instead, it can be about developing certain skills that you might not have. So if you're a software engineer that doesn't have a lot of business background, maybe there are programs where your company can help you uh, learn about business on the side. If you're a, uh, a product manager and you haven't done a lot of public speaking, maybe there are ways for you to acquire that skill with the support of the company. These are ways to get ahead without directly getting a straight up and down promotion. And it allows you to sort of chart your own career path in ways that are flexible and, and meet the changing needs of a 21st century company.